Wench. I'm such an adult. There's no need to celebrate your birthday specially, right? That's not okay. I have to give you a surprise. How about forgetting it? The company has many affairs. I may not be able to spare time yet. Good. Listen to you. We still have a lot of time. You really think that my sister is nothing but air? But as long as my sister is happy, I can pretend I didn't see anything. You admitted that you are my sister. That's you taking advantage of my sister. When will you take a break? When will there be a sister like me, Ji Yuman? Are you promising? It certainly won't take a lot of time. Lao Lu, early morning call. Is it an emergency? After an inspection by the Lu family headquarters, I think Miss Ji is not qualified to be the young wife of the Lu family. Master Lu married him again. The Lu family's judgment on Miss Ji. Not very nice. Explain. Lao Lu. No worries in front of you. The Lu family headquarters believes that. The Lu family is little mentally retarded. Insufficient ability. Poor appearance and family background, and overcrowded relatives. It's hard to be the young mistress of the Lu family. What qualifications do those old guys have to decide my wife? He kicked me out of the Lu family back then. Now you still want to point fingers at me. Absolutely impossible. Then your decision is. Take Jiangbei District. The old guys at the Lu family headquarters will temporarily shut their mouths. Ji Yu Mingzi is the person sent by the headquarters to monitor us. Has he been up to anything recently? Ji Yu Mingzi wants to check the accounts of our Lu company in Jiangbei District. It's clear who's looking for us. Let him find. And it's best to let him see the company's financial statements. Company financial statements. How could you show it to Ji Yu Mingzi casually? Just let him see. After that, he will be asked to get out of Jiangbei obediently. Lu Feng. I'm going to attend my aunt's daughter's wedding soon. We need to prepare gifts in advance. Good as you expected. I remember it. This article is written by Shui Yu and I as a wedding gift for your daughter. Snow and rain. What does your family mean? My daughter is getting married. Just give me this broken tea bowl. You married. Give me this tea bowl worth 10 yuan. This is a purple clay pot. Not something broken. We sincerely send it. If you are sincere, just send the goods to this stall. Get out of here now. You are not welcome at this wedding. But, fine, let me explain. How about we make a bet? How dare you throw this purple clay pot with your own hands? We'll leave immediately. You popper junior. How dare you pick on your elders? Incredible. Just throw it down. My daughter's wedding. It's not the turn of relatives like you to act arrogantly. What are you doing? This brother. Your mother-in-law just broke the purple clay pot given to us by Ji Shuiyu's family. This is a purple clay pot set worth 17 million. Who took this precious purple stone? How is it possible 17 million? This is just a broken teacup. I dropped it. But it can't be worth 17 million. What a fool. The person I am marrying is a foreigner. Don't understand the value of genuine goods. The sincerity of the gift giver. They're all treated like donkey liver and lungs. This marriage. You, don't go. It's all my fault. Why don't you get married? Mom. Aren't you embarrassed? How dare you be so mean with a gift worth 7 million yuan? You killed me. The groom ran away. This is really... That white-eyed wolf. How dare you abandon my daughter like this. In the future, there will be no descendants. My job is to be a connoisseur. You just dropped such a precious purple clay pot. And gifts are of any value. Part of your heart. Can't even respect. Is it better not to get married? Seventeen million gifts were thrown away. He also cursed his son-in-law to cut off his children and grandchildren. It's really kind of you to treat me like a donkey. Snob. This marriage is probably not going to end well. Let's go back. Are you leaving now? Our courtesy has been fulfilled. Your company still has things to be busy with, right? Um. Then let's go. Lu Feng. That 17 million purple clay teapot set. You didn't ask President Lu Wangguan to buy it again, did you? 
Just an acquaintance.